Well, Paul Bosch was Mr. Houston Wrestling. He did all the interviews. He welcomed you to the show. He did all the play-by-play -play and all the commentary on the television show. So Paul was Houston Wrestling. You know, it's, it's a promoter's choice to make you a star, you know, a winner. And um, Gino was being put in that light. And um, the rumor was, was that Gino was his Ill illegitimate son. I think Paul looked at Gino as a son, and, and, and he loved him. Beyond the rumor and innuendo and people saying that, I have zero evidence that Gino was Paul's son at all. I have no idea. I think the only one that could answer that that's alive would be Gino's mom. Well, honey, I can tell you absolutely not. <laughs> absolutely not. I mean, I was... I was 16 years old when I had Gino. I didn't even know who Paul Bosch was then. You know, Gino's father was Charles Eugene Walsh. Strangely enough, when we were having the funeral, or they put the notice in the paper, uh, I heard from Gino's father because they had put his, his real name in the paper. He would be going to the wrestling matches every Friday night as a security guard, a policeman and watching Gino wrestle, and he didn't know that was his son until they published Gino's real name, and he got in touch with me, and uh, I told him, I said, you really missed out on a fine young man.